player. played this guy. I did. I thought his tag was just CBT. Oh yeah, Skeets the White Kazi. Yeah, I know because it's like he's got the Skeet skin. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's how I remember. Yeah, I played I've, this I've, guy. I've commentated Skeet before actually. Yeah, about it. I've had to play him at like the last two Xenos I was at. So we're gonna see how he fares against this hero right now. Getting those combos on deck. That's oh, one thing. Oh. That's the the fair uh, the second air might as well have connected right there. Yeah, um, no, uh, no uh, Silvio air dodging. Gonna gonna SD unfortunately. Okay. Ooh, these extensions. Uh, he's gotta chill out. Most definitely. Yeah. All right, we got we got Silvio getting back into it, getting the getting the buffs on deck, and the. Kaboom out there. And and Skeet just standing here. He's yeah, like, yeah, I mean Skeet not you. really gonna contest it. Which uh, I don't know if that's the play because Definitely he, not. Oh. Uh, because you do not want Hero to get that accelerado, get that psych up, get that uh bounce. Oh Ooh, reading the roll in, and I mean Silvio is right back in this game. And not now I believe. Beat. Yeah, not missed a beat since that uh And then all started once Skeet stopped pressuring. Like Skeet started the game off. Went right into him, electric wing god fist while he was so he couldn't get the menu out and almost took a like, two whole stocks from that. Then stopped yeah, applying pressure and kill. finally gets to break through. Has not done percent in so long before that. Oh, yeah. I really like that up B. Pretty much did 70 in that first interaction, but uh, and then getting that throw. But we got we got Silvio kind of playing more in his range, not allowing CBT to or uh, Skeet to get in. We got him at the ledge now, though. Those uppies getting him out of that pressure. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, the job gonna gonna finish that stock for Kazuya there. The, gotta hit him with the snooze. We're sleeping on him. Oh, Ooh. these uppies have been so clutch. I wonder if Skeet's gonna start shielding and yeah, just perhaps. trying you to can, punch it. You can definitely get a punish. Honest, honestly, though, even if you do shield, it is kind of hard to punish if they have the PS2 platform. Yeah, that's too. right. Yeah, I, that, that could be why we're we're looking at this stage right now. Using those platforms to advantage to uh, make that a little less laggy. All right. Oh, I think he grabbed him right there. The command grab trading. Mm -hmm. We got no establishing some some presence on this ledge, but that you know any hit from Kazuya could be very oh, scary. Oh, that could have been scary. If yeah, that, if he did not jump. Get the grounded version. That could be death. Oh, that was clean. Yeah, we haven't oh, seen we like him calling around the air at all. So I really like that double jump fair mm -hmm. from Skeet. We got a Celerado on deck. If, if Skeet gets off stage, we could be looking at a dead Kazuya and gonna oh. go for that fourth bear, but not gonna get it. Oh, and really good not drifting in fully. Managed to have a second chance at life. That was a great recovery from Skeet. And Must now, oh. You, you, getting around you flew that, too uh, close to the sun right there with that. Ooh, uh, maybe it's meant to drop off. Yeah, you gotta watch out for that Kazuya burst range when he's got that, uh, that rage guy. Tech? Oh. Ooh, no tech on the up. He definitely was techable. Yeah. Um, Skeet unfortunately missing that tech. I mean, I, that, yeah, that first stock was, yeah. was pretty crazy. Yeah, I mean, he wouldn't have continued that combo if, if Noah had not, or Sylvia had not air dodged. Yeah, I wonder if Silvio could have jumped right there and it would have, if he would have gone out. I mean, he probably could have just waited or something. I don't think uh, Skeet was at the the range in which you could have hit him with another nair. Yeah, it lo it looked like it wasn't gonna got... like, um, it looked like he was good to jump or maybe like drift yeah. down and recover. Mm -hmm. Those uppies were all, all off the stage were huge in in getting. Oh out. no! I think a lot of Skeet's problems. Um, Along with kind of letting Silvio get menu up too much, I think oh, it was also a problem with um, he kind of overheated sometimes. He like would get one combo, then like go for something crazy. And, yeah. Uh, and yeah. Silvio kind of just jumped over it almost always. Yeah, I, know, I mean, a lot of the, you know, pretty risky call out options that Skeet was going for, no, kind of just shield, up B, get out of there real quick. Oh, we got. It's yodeling time, guys. We got so, SBT, so SBT with oh, the thanks, sub. Thanks for the sub, SBT. Four years. years. That's, that's dedication. <laughs> that's my goat. Oh, it's yodeling time. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. I just be realized beautiful what, song what in the background. Time, man. <laughs> I just listened to the song. Reminds oh, me of CBT a better day that time when I was yodeling. Yeah. You see CBT kind of going for these burst options oh. to try and catch Silvio at the same timing pretty much every time. And I mean, Silvio's just having none of it, you know, hitting him for that. And something interesting, so Silvio banned FD, which makes sense, in town and city. And instead of going to Kalos, Skeet chose uh, 
Um, Skeet chose small battlefield, and I don't know if I agree with that because he's kind of suffering from the same problems that he suffered on PS2, where uh, Silvio has this platform to play around so much, and it's really hard for Kazi to deal with it with his slow jump. So. Oh yeah, for sure. I mean, Noah or Silvio is one of those players that will definitely use those platforms to his advantage with that up B, you know, giving him a little bit of cover to throw out those spells a little more safely. Jab not going to kill, going for the laser. He had bounce up. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, I think he literally flicked down one. last second when he realized he had bounce. So yeah. really hit. <laughs> um, but yeah, able to close it out. And this is one Kazuya combo, honestly. But for sure, for sure. How on point are you? I feel like he's not been super crazy with the punch game. Yeah, he did get that started. one. You know, he, he's proven that he's capable, but we'll see if he even gets the neutral opener. I mean, Ooh. Silvio kind of just boxing him out very effectively. Oh. And that psych up dash tag is going to kill. Yeah, oomphed and psyched up. That was super killing. That was double cheeked up dash tag right there. Going to take that kill. Oh, oh crossing was, up. Okay. Second. <laughs> What even just happened? That was wild. Like, Dude, you gotta get back on for that low key that was killing the pit. <laughs> Yeah. Oh! Ooh, yeah. Unable to extend that platform, you know. Kazuya kinda getting stuck, or that combo, Kazuya kinda getting Ooh, stuck on okay, the platform. Okay, that was clean. For sure, for oh, sure. the Accelerado. I mean, the Accelerado has just been getting Silvio back to stage so frequently. You know, you, at, this, at this point, you kinda gotta adjust the spacing in which you, you're trying to cover. His yeah. hero is just out of there. I think, honestly, if Accelerado is up, you just should not be lasering because it's such a slow, laggy laser. Yeah, and that hero is... can literally jump at you in time and the flak. Honestly, I haven't seen a thwack kill Call in a Joe minute. Lacking. I I have, unfortunately. Uh, I'm sorry. But we're, we're going to see the thwack closing it out right there. Yeah, and honestly, I feel like outside of the first 15 seconds, Skeet never really knew how to find footing in yeah, this match. Yeah, he, he got that one, you know, early stock off the SD, giving him a chance to, to take that game one. I mean... That just that just covers. <laughs> what does that not cover? Yeah. Is the question you should be asking. It's